Hey guys, Two Dime Marine here, uh, bringing you another midweek motivation. Uh, this week I decided to do a Navy Corman's uh, Medal of Honor citation uh, because for this week's Marine Corps stories, I'm going to be talking about Corman. So uh, I found one that uh, I had heard about before. Um, just what he did is you know, amazing, in my opinion. It's pretty much the always are, though. But, uh,. Yeah, without further ado, here's a citation for George E. Wallen, W-A-H-L-E-N. He was a, at the time of the award, he was a pharmacist mate, seventh class. For conspicuous gallantry and intrepidity at the risk of his life above and beyond the call of duty, while serving with 2nd Battalion, 26 Marines, 5th Marine Division, during action against enemy Japanese forces on Iwo Jima and the Volcano Group on 3rd March, 1945. Painfully wounded in the bitter action on 26 February, Petty Officer Wallen remained on the battlefield, advancing well forward of the front lines to aid a wounded Marine and carrying him back to safety despite a terrific concentration of fire. Tireless in his administrations, he constantly disregarded all danger to attend his fighting comrades as they fell under the devastating rain of shrapnel and bullets, and rendered prompt assistance to various elements of his combat group as required. When the adjacent platoon suffered heavy casualties, Petty Officer Wallen defied the continuous pounding of heavy mortars and deadly fire of enemy rifles to care for the wounded, working rapidly in an area swept by constant fire and treating 14 casualties before returning to his own platoon. Wounded again on March 2nd, he gallantly refused evacuation, moving out with his company the following day in a fur furious assault across 600 yards of open terrain and repeatedly rendered rendering medical aid while exposed to the blasting fury of powerful Japanese guns. Stout-hearted and indomitable, he persevered in his determined efforts as his unit waged fierce battle, and unable to walk after sustaining a third agonizing wound, resolutely crawled 50 yards to administer first aid to still another fallen fighter. By his dauntless fortitude and valor, Petty Officer Wallen served as a constant inspiration and contributed vitally to the high morale of his company during critical phases of the strategically important engagement. By his heroic spirit, self-sacrifice, and efforts, in all the devotion to duty, Petty Officer Wallen reflected great credit upon himself and upheld the highest traditions of the United States Naval Service. Now that's, uh, kind of goes to show you why Marines love their corpsmen. Because that's, uh, that's some craziness right there. But alright, guys, I will, uh, cut it here. I'll uh, see you again on Friday with uh, Marine Corps stories. S Semper Fortis and Semper Fidelis.